This is my 1955 DeSoto Fire Dome 56 grill. This car is currently going to be on eBay. It's another one of my fine prize possessions. This is some pinstriping done by my daddy, my buddy Derek here in uh, Denver, Colorado. Besties Customs. Best part about these cars, <coughs> this is the uh, 291 DeSoto Fire Dome Hemi. Uh, this car came from the factory with a two barrel, but it has a Fire Flight one year, one model only, four barrel intake and carb, which is really nice. It's got the uh, power steering, uh, no power brakes, um, generator but it has a Chevy alternator. I didn't put that on, but it works. So it's all 12 volt instead of six. Put the chrome headlight bezels on it. Looks pretty cool. As well as the baby moons and the chrome steel wheels, front and rear. These are more of a deep dish but I couldn't find any baby moons that fit these. Minor detail. Uh, also put on the, uh, this I believe is from a 56 DeSoto uh, chrome visor, which it didn't have from the factory. The interior's been redone. It's pretty clean. Uh, I didn't do the re interior. The dash has got a little peeling and whatnot, but that's what makes it cool. There's the original clock. Um, steering wheel is pretty decent. Um, interior's kind of like velour with a vinyl. Not factory, but it's got the original headliner in it. A little tear there, oops. But the uh, back seat's got a, a lot of nice room for uh, romance and whatever you want to do back there. Let's see, let's get a better view. Go around to the back here. I put dual exhaust on the car, it doesn't come out the back. Uh, here's more pinstriping done by Derek. Very cool, very 50s. And of course, you gotta paint this on all your Hemi cars. Yes, it does. Here's the trunk, pretty dang clean, no real major cancer of any kind or rat's nest. Jacks and various whatnots in here. But I drive and run this car pretty much almost daily, so it runs and drives really nicely. The exhaust sounds really nice, it's got dual gold sonotone mufflers straight through. This is a little Crustum from the 50s diamond little back cover thing. This is the other side. Not a whole lot of rust in here. This car is kept pretty clean. The car came actually from California. I know a lot of people say that, but it actually did. It's pretty clean for a Colorado car. I got the car, it had been sitting for 10 years, cleaned it up and got it running. Did redid the brakes and changed all the fluids and spark plugs and what have you. So needless to say, it's a very cool car. Runs real good. Sounds real good. And it's something you can drive and enjoy and restore. So let's give it a quick little start up here. Fires right up. Gauges are all pretty clean and what have you. Who knows if that's the original mileage? A little ashtray and stuff. Pretty cool. It's got the little vent on the cowl that you can open for fresh air. Who needs AC, right? Wind 
windshield on this is actually pretty narrow. It feels like you're driving a shop top custom car, but this is the way they came. It's your little RPM. But anyways, screams, runs good, sounds good, and uh, hope you like it too, and please throw a bit on eBay for me. Thanks.